Yeah, massively. I think we've had a really long winter, a good pre-season. We've been playing some county cricket as well, so we've just been really excited to get out there in our first competitive game, all together, all on the same side, um, and lay down a marker for, for the 2022 season. I think the way we played last year was fantastic, but you know we, we really wanted that Charlotte Edwards Cup. So I think that's a big focus for us this year, and to go out on Saturday how we did, put in the performance that we did, I think it was, it was really pleasing, and we couldn't really have asked for a better start. Yeah, because I don't think you can replicate games when you're in training, um, you know, the feeling of being out there in the middle with the bat, the time on your feet, all that sort of stuff. Um, so to have played, you know, four weeks or so of, of warm-up games of county cricket, that's prepared us really nicely going into, um, into Saturday and, and this season. And I think the girls looked like they'd been playing for a while, it didn't look like the first game of the season. Um, people are you know, going out there and expressing themselves from ball one. So I think that's really pleasing. It's something that we speak about a lot, the Vipers being brave and, and having that intent and going out there and, and playing the way that we play. So to be able to do that in that first game and do it as well as we did was really pleasing. Yeah, absolutely. It's not something that we, we get to do very often um, in the domestic setup. So uh, we're really looking forward to it. Love playing here at the Aegeus and we hope that we can get a decent crowd in to, to come and support us. Yeah, so I think the obvious challenge is, is the sky when it gets dark, um, learning to catch under lights. The balls can sometimes behave a little bit differently under lights when you're batting, when you're bowling. Talk about some dew might come into play, but on the whole, it'll just be, um, I, I suppose the biggest thing is like waiting around all day for the game. That's probably the worst thing. But once we get out there, um, it, it won't be too different. We've all trained and, and played enough cricket to know that it, it, it is just another game. So we're really looking forward to it. Um, yeah, hopefully, like I said, we can get a big crowd in and, and they can really get behind us because we love that support. Yeah, they've, they've recruited well this winter. They've um, Obviously, having Tammy come back into the fold really strengthens their batting and Kirsty Gordon's been a great performer at domestic level for, for a number of years. So we're aware of their threats. Um, I think that we're very confident that if we bring our best cricket, um, will be too strong for them but like you said in T20 cricket anyone can can take the game away from you and and we've got to be really really on it we can't be complacent we've had a really good start to our season and it's about now maintaining those standards and lifting them and being better every game yeah it will be the first time this year and we love playing here we've got good memories of playing here um, like I said the Charlotte Edwards Cup is, is a trophy that we really want to win so putting down a, a marker is really important for us and being able to play two games at home to start the, the competition is is really good for us and hopefully we'll get some good support, the crowd will get behind us and that will lift us a little bit too.